Guys, back again. Um, excuse the one the I don't fucking care. If I look stupid, it's a pig. Who cares? I look cute. But I just wanted to do a little fucking rant video. What's this? This is a game. This is a PlayStation 2 game. What's this? This is an Xbox One game. This is two fucking generations ago, right? This is two generations ago. This is high-tech, modern, HD, graphics, technology, amazing fucking game system. No, it's not. This... Oh, right. Here's the thing. I can put this game in right now into my PlayStation and I can fucking play this game right fucking now. This, however, you know the story behind how long it took fucking Halo to install. This, it, take for, it took a while to install, but the game installed and it works fine. Guess what? The game needed a fucking update right fucking now. And the internet is so fucking sh slow. Look at this. Look at this. Look how fast that's blinking. That means the internet is fucking slow, right? Updating my video, right? Uploading my video. You know the story. When I upload my videos, it drains the internet. I'm not uploading the video, but earlier, guess what? I was playing the Xbox 360, the, the system, before the Xbox One. I was playing it. Even though the internet wasn't working, the games were working fine, right? Heather wanted to play Attack on Titan. For some reason, it said, oh, she needs to sync her data, which makes no sense because she wasn't playing it on another system. She was playing it on the system she was playing it on, right? That's fucking bullshit. And guess what? Oh, my God. It kept signing her out. It goes, it keeps signing you out. Why? Why, why, why does it keep doing that? And the achievements aren't unlocking either. Oh, Xbox, guess what? Your system don't fucking work. Now, I know a lot of people are going to go, oh, well, you we should have got a PS4 then. Who gives a fuck? I've got Xbox One. I'll get a PS4 later. I don't care. This isn't about console wars. This is about modern fucking systems being a piece of fucking crap. What is this? And the game, the game is great. Don't get me wrong, I love this game. But it, it baffles my mind to think that there's that it's the modern HD graphics, all this shit. Why do you need to install the game to begin with? You didn't have to do that on Xbox 360. I know a lot of people be like, oh, it's to install the bigger files. You didn't have to do that on the Xbox 360. The games run fine on Xbox 360. Oh, yes, some of them. Some of them work better when you install it on your hard drive. Fair enough, right? Fair enough, there's a reason why. But it baffles my mind. The fact is, right, I can't play this now. The game is, has to do an update. I know the game just got a patch. Fair enough. There's some thing, problems wrong, wrong with the game. Do it through a patch. Good, right? That's, that's one way, you know, that's something that's great about modern systems. But you, why do you need to install it? It's not a PC. Installing games should be stick to fucking PC. And it makes me laugh so fucking much, right, that people sit there and go, I'm a true gamer. I fucking play Xbox One or PS4. How? How is that gaming? A true gamer. This is true gaming. Put, a, put this in. Put this in right now. I know it's a completely different game. I don't care. It's Sam Rowell's. It was the first game that I just took off the shelf just to show for this video. I can put this game in right now. Play it. And that's gaming for me. This. Put it in. It has to install. And, and if you have shit internet, you're fucking waiting. Oh my god. How long do you have to wait? Will you leave me alone? Freaking, you have to wait so fucking long. Why do you need to wait to play a game? You shouldn't have to wait. The only time you should wait to play a game is when you're waiting to buy the game. If you don't have the game, that's the time you only should wait to play a game. That's not gaming. Gaming is not sitting there for four hours while, or however long it takes while a system, a game installs. That's not gaming. Gaming is putting a game in and playing it. It's bullshit. It's fucking ridiculous. And I know uh, if the PlayStation 4, it probably is the same. If I had a PlayStation 4, it would be the same. I don't care what anyone says. It would be the fucking same. It's because modern systems depend on the Xbox, not sorry, modern systems depend on internet. Why? Even if you don't have internet, why do you need internet to play a game? The only time you should need internet to play a game is when you play it online. PlayStation 2, a system, 2000, this system come out, games work on it fine. A console, 16 years old, you can get a console that's 16 years old and it will still work. You can get NESs, that still work. 
And how old are they now? An Xbox One, you can get it, and it will break within a two years. <coughs> they don't care. Guys, let me complete, let me tell you the fucking truth. They don't care. Xbox, they, they, Microsoft, they don't care. They'll make a system go, oh, we got great games on the system, but guess what? We don't care. Oh, we're, we're going to bring a new system out in two years' time. Let's give the lifespan of our system two years. Because instead of going, you know what, let's make a system to last, uh, instead, let's make a new system and charge people another 400 quid to buy it. <gasps> Oh, that's a great idea. Really? Really? It's not gaming, guys. Gaming is playing a game. And I know I'm giving a lot of love to the PlayStation 2. I don't care. I fucking love the PlayStation 2. It is my favourite system of all time. And it is a true gaming system. Because you can put the game in and fucking play it. Even Xbox 360 is the same. I can put a game into the Xbox 360. Even if the internet's not working. And I can fucking play it. Maybe I can't do online, but who cares? If you can't do online, you can't do online. The games these days, especially games these days, focus too much on fucking line. And it's the problem. Why is some why are the Xbox One and PlayStation 4 dependent on internet? The internet, not everyone can afford amazing internet. We are gonna get our internet sorted. I don't care. Heather reckons it's the signal around here. I might, I might agree with her. There is probably the signal is shit around here. You can't do much about that. But at the end of the day, it sh doesn't matter because you don't. Why, why do you need to depend on fucking online? I wanted to play WWE 2K17. I wanted to beat fucking John Cena up. No, no, I'm joking. John Cena's a legend. But I wanted to, you know what I mean. I wanted to play this game. I really did. I just wanted to play some Xbox while Heather's at work. It's freaking half seven now. She's going to be home in a, at ten, but after ten. I know a lot of people going, well, why don't you just play the PlayStation if you love it so much? <coughs> I might. But the problem is, if I turn the fucking console off, it's going to have to install again tomorrow. So I might as well just wait. Five gigabytes. It's just it's taking two hours or whatever it is. It's just ridiculous, guys. It's fucking ridiculous. Why are consoles dependent online? I know this is a rant. If you're not interested in this, I don't care. Don't, don't, don't just flag the video going, oh, you're hating on systems. Don't, do not comment, you should have got a PS4. Because if you comment, you should have got a PS4, I'm just going to block the comment because I don't want to hear it, okay? Yes, oh, or get a PC. But even if I had a PC or a PS4, I'd have the same issue because it's dependent online. Why? And the worst part about it is the game says ready to play, but it's not the full game. It's doing the same thing where you only get one, you, you can only do one match with only like eight people like you could when you're installing the game. I've already installed the fucking game. It's just an update. You, ugh. Ugh. Sorry. <laughs> you should, you should still be able to fucking play a game. I've installed it. It's just fucking baffles my mind how mad and how stupid fucking game companies and game system developers are these days they don't care about people anymore they're just trying to get money out of you and that's it and that's sad it's sad that the playstation 2 is superior to an xbox one for the main reason you can fucking play it straight away this you can't you shouldn't have to wait. You shouldn't have to wait to play your games. You should be able to put your game in and play it. That is the truth. I don't care what you think. That's the truth. A system, a game system, is something you can put in and play. It's like fucking going to the cinema, isn't it? We go, why do you watch a movie at... You know, go to the cinema. You're going to have to watch all the stupid trailers for other movies and all that shit. Whereas, get the DVD, you can skip all that. You can, you know, that's why I don't go to the cinema. Well, that and I don't see the point of fucking paying £10 to watch a movie once when I can pay £10 when it comes on DVD and watch it whenever the fuck I want. But this has just been a little rant video. I just wanted to get it off my chest because the Xbox One has really been pissing me off lately. And again, if I had a PS4 or a PC, it would do the same thing. Um...
at the end of the day, stop making consoles dependent online. You should be able to put a game in and play it. That's the that's the end of the story. End of the story. PlayStation 2 is superior to an Xbox One or PS4 because I can put a game in and I can fucking play it. This. I don't fucking know. Um, this has been a rant video, so if you enjoyed this, if you enjoy these rant videos, let me know because I, I've got a lot of things to rant on. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed these videos, please leave a thumbs up. Uh, leave a thumbs up for the piggy man. You know, gotta look, gotta look cute. I know I don't look cute with this fucking shaving thing growing on, but just leave a like, um, give me some support. I will always appreciate it. Let me know if you agree with me. Um, don't just don't com if you're gonna leave a comment below, just let you leave something nice. Don't don't leave a stupid comment like the PlayStation Four is better. Blah blah blah. Because at the end of the day, they're both the same thing to me. They both you, they're both gonna have the same issue with internet. But yeah, and uh, of course, if you want to see more videos, uh, feel free to subscribe and uh, join the family. Of course, and uh, um, as I always say, have a nice day, and uh, I'll see you again soon. If I'm gonna do another rant video, but yeah, this has just been a little round video. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you again soon. See you later.